Hi guys, today our topic will be ways to make sure that you bought a proper car which matches for you. Patrick's garage. I personally never going to buy two doors car. I don't know which prefer you and why. I don't want to buy two doors car. Just because it's not so convenient to passengers, I think. And uh, door hinges also were more faster, you know, door more bigger and you know that hinges will be worn more faster. Now I think that average guy knows about SUV. Also, I also prefer to driving big cars with big volume of engine and a lot of room inside. This is more convenient, but yes, the next question will be gas mileage. What more important for you? The car with frame also consumes a lot of gasoline because of weight. And a very important thing that power of car which volume of engine more better which appropriate for your character how you want to uh, driving yes i'm not uh, never driving like a maniac but i like that car have power yes you never going to compare a uh, five liters engine normally aspirated engine with uh, let's say 1.8 liters gasoline engine turbo turbocharged engine like Volkswagen you never going to compare this engine because uh, turbo this is just good for papers yes it consumes not a lot of gasoline but on the papers when you step on the gas in turbo small turbo engine it will consume a lot of gasoline and all the paper gas mileage goes goes away goes down the toilet and uh, question about transmission i think you prefer automatic transmission yes i'm also but more enjoyable with manual transmission driving but if you're driving all the day will be better of course automatic transmission i prefer if you work as a driver will be better automatic transmission but for personal using, of course, manual transmission, more enjoyable driving with manual transmission. What do you prefer? Front wheel drive car or rear wheel drive car? Or maybe all wheel drive, four wheel drive car? I think that will be enough. Rear wheel drive. I personally prefer rear wheel drive or all-wheel drive cars without uh, shifting for rear-wheel drive or all-wheel drive. All-wheel drive I prefer, if I honestly say. Considering that I'm cheapskate, I prefer rear-wheel drive for owning, for my own cars, I prefer rear-wheel drive with manual transmission yes one only one axle drives uh, you get uh, more better gas mileage maybe front wheel drive cars gets better gas mileage but i prefer for me rear wheel drive car and yes main thing all the time you're sitting inside so car interior Car interior should be appropriate for you in a lot of cases. Yes, maybe you prefer sunroof, moonroof, but I personally can't trust moonroof, sunroof because they eventually moonroof always starts leaking. 
with time. And yes, if it's leaking, penetration of water inside the current error gets mold and mildew, horrible smell. You can get horrible smell if you anywhere has a leakage, water gets inside. That's not good. Which upholstery will be better inside? I personally prefer for my own cars fabric, not leather. Leather will be better to car which you using for work. If your driver will be better leather car, but when it hot it will be too hot when uh, cold it will be too cold but a brick cloth i think that more better option than leather and yes as i mentioned earlier five liter engines will be more better than two liter engine with turbo because it breath deep breath you know when 5 liter engine accelerates it accelerates more easier you you feel that it deep breath and uh, this is more enjoyable than a small engine with turbo yes with turbo we like uh, filthy filthy dirty rape the small gasoline engine with turbo this is not good for engine it wears out more fast with turbo small engine turbo good uh, as i think only for diesel engines yes that's good so with turbo it will be dirty filthy rape for engine and what more important always we make this question and then we get I get answer when I know what more important gas mileage or comfortable driving probably it will be a last point uh, any guys consider that if you check couple times and you return to check the locked car is it locked or not this is good and this is means you like your car if you return back and you look back to your car when you walk away you want to return to check no this is just paranoia so if you walked away and then looked back to the car maybe something wrong maybe opened a window this is means nothing that not means that you like this car if you enjoy have enjoyable driving if you enjoy when you sitting inside and you enjoying how looks the interior how power how accelerates what can give you your uh, your car can give you if it's enjoyable that means this is your car i'm really appreciate your liking sharing and subscribe thank you so much for your time bye for now